Hi, this is Nathan, your neighbor at Arcade and Pinball Talk Guy. We're here at the Single Ship in Indianapolis, Indiana, reviewing Starship Troopers by Sega today. Please look for our review underneath the description of our video, as well as like and follow us on our social media formats, Arcade and Pinball Talk on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, as well as click that red subscribe button. Subscribe now. If you like Arcade, if you like Pinball, in all of its formats, join our family. Click subscribe. Let's go ahead and get this review underway, shall we? First impressions of this table is very unique. Flippers are actually a wide gap there, and uh, they're offset to the left, and you got a second button down there for a third flipper that's pink right there. So definitely a different kind of setup. Modes are in the middle, middle warrior hopper, tanker, plasma, shoot targets to kill. Almost reminds me of Oktoberfest. You got that third drunk flipper where you got those two buttons and you just gotta use it sometimes. Also monsters for the mini play field. Got a bug that pops out of the middle of the table, as you can see right there. Soundtrack is okay, it's what you would expect. It's almost like playing the Sega machine back in the day. That's kind of the soundtrack to it. Sound bites are okay. Art is actually just okay on this machine too. Again, it's Sega, so it's decent. Play so far has been okay. So first things first, I mean, table mechanics, two end lanes, so left, right. You have an exit lane left, right. You got arm nukes, which is a kick out, kind of a scoop kick out to the left. You have a lane that goes all the way around to the columns, a ramp that comes back around, have a trail as your left end lane. You have a super nuke with the alien, which goes up and down. Uh, so you hit that back there, live fire assault range. You have targets with pop bumpers in the columns to the center. You got a super bug, which is to the right, which has a drop target and a scoop there. Ramp going up and around back to your right in lane habit trail. And then you have a lane going around back to the columns again with some targets below that. Very simple setup. Come on, you maggot! Almost has a magnet uh, that stops the ball above the U on bug. So I have noticed that. Today we will be liberating Tilly. Destroy everything! And you also got a full orbit on this machine. So that's pretty cool. So going around the full orbit to the back, it can either, if you hit it hard enough, go down through the columns, or not hard enough, go down through the columns, or it will go all the way around to a full orbit. So that's good. Keeps the flow of the game going. Right down the middle. Anyway, all in all, decent game. I mean, artwork could have been better. Theme is okay at Starship Troopers, so back in the day it was good. Uh, but other than that, definitely worth a shot. Find it if you get an opportunity to find it in route. Uh, please look for our review again in the description of our YouTube video. And again, thank you for your time today. Arcade and Pinball Talk signing off.